British Rail Engineering Limited (BREL), incorporated on the 31st of October 1969, was the railway systems engineering subsidiary of British Rail until the design and building of trains in the UK was privatised in 1989. Topic: <laughs> Main products. The vast majority of BREL's output was rolling stock for British Rail, including Mark I, Mark II and Mark III carriages, the latter for locomotive haulage and intercity 125 diesel high-speed trains. BREL built the near 80 class diesel electric multiple units for Northern Ireland Railways. Other Mark III derived vehicles included class 150 diesel multiple units in the 1980s and numerous electric multiple units such as classes 313 and 317. BREL had limited success in the export market, notably with Mark II and Mark III carriages for Irish Rail and the Taiwan Railway EMU 100 series. Other products BREL built prototypes such as the Class 210 DEMU and the Experimental High Speed Advanced Passenger Train apt tilting during the 1970s and early 1980s. The Class 210 were externally very similar to the first batch of Class 317 EMUs, but half of the forward carriage was taken up by the engine room. Power was provided by an above-floor diesel engine driving a generator to power traction motors on the axles. A single engine was fitted at one end of the unit. Locations BREL major production centres were at Crew Crew Works, Derby Derby Litchurch Lane Works and Derby Works, Doncaster Doncaster Works, Shildon Shildon Works and York BREL York. The historic site at Wolverton in Milton Keynes was progressively run down until the 1980s before being relegated to maintenance duties. Not all British Rail rolling stock was built in-house, Metro Camel, Brush Traction and Metropolitan Vickers amongst others manufactured rolling stock, although in general it was built to BREL specifications. Latterly, BREL often acted as a subcontractor to a main contractor such as GEC, which supplied traction equipment. These contracts required BREL to build the frames, body shells and bogies, and install the traction and ancillary equipment of the primary contractor. Much of the electric locomotive construction program of the 1980s, such as classes 87, 90 and 91, was carried out in this way. Privatization <inaudible> 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 In 1989 BREL was purchased by the Swiss-Swedish conglomerate AB ASEA Brown Bovary 40%, Trafalgar House 40%, and a MEBO management employee buyout 20%. In 1992 it was bought out by AB to form AB Transportation Limited. It has since become part of Bombardier Transportation. The privatisation of British Rail led to a hiatus in the ordering of rolling stock, which predictably led to the almost complete collapse of the rolling stock manufacturing industry. When purchases of rolling stock resumed, with little remaining capacity in the UK contracts were increasingly placed overseas. In 1996, BREL York closed. In 2005 the unrelated Metro Camel plant in Washwood Heath, Birmingham closed which meant that for 10 years from 2005 to 2015 Bombardier's former BREL site, the Derby Litchurch Lane Works, was the sole plant in the UK actively manufacturing stock. This unique role was ended by Hitachi and John Lang in 2015, who opened the Agility Trains factory in County Durham. CAF have since built a £30 million factory at Clanware near Newport. Like Metro Camel, BREL helped in the planning, design and, on occasion, the manufacturing of London Underground stock. See also Intercity 125 Advanced passenger train Intercity 225 British Rail London Underground 1986 stock